Hello guys, we're uh, we're back with more Hollow Knight, continuing yeah! our exploration of Green Path. We're going to kiss Hollow Knight. What? We're going to kiss Hollow Knight. You want to kiss the Hollow Knight? Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> Do whatever you want, bud. Just leave me he's, out of it. He's kind of chained up right now, isn't he? Yeah. Yeah. You like that? Yeah. Is that your cat? Yeah, my cat demands attention. Your cat's a whore. He is. That's He's not fair. Also, I can't hear anything, by the way. <laughs> oh, you can't? No. I don't know why. I thought I could at first, but I guess not. Oh. Uh, yeah, I think I know why. Um. I think you may just have to... I think you might just have to deal with that. Sorry. Wait, did what? I think you might just have to deal with that. Sorry. Okay. Uh, huh? No, that's all good. That's all good. I know what's going on anyway, so it's fine. It's mostly visual. Yeah. And you've already heard the amazing soundtrack. Oh my god. And of course, you can always, like, since this is co-op, you can always play side by side, since that's what it was intended for. Yeah. Ah, uh, I sure do love the abyss. I love blind platforming, don't you? Absolutely. Fuck. Oh my gosh. Oh, no. Also, I think it's really cool they went. Like, I know, I know it was for simplicity's sake, but I think it's really cool they went with the bug theming. Yeah. Stop! Stop it! You bite on my cord, I bite on you. I eat you. What, what if he's into that? Um. Well, he fights with my other cat about trying to eat his tail, so I don't think so. Oh. Uh, what if they're both into that? Maybe. Well, clearly he's not into it. I mean... <laughs> he's not that kind of guy. He's not that guy, pal? No. Oh my god. Oh uh, no, it didn't save. I'm gonna lose it. So uh I'm I'm in the no eyes area, but I don't have a lamp or a dream nail, so I can't really do shit here. Except yeah. forget that mask shard. Fuck. Ooh. I don't like that there's no audio here at all, except mine. Yeah. Is that is it that way with the, with the lamp as well? I don't remember. No, it's bet. You know what? I'll just wait until I get the lamp. Uh, the lamp makes it better. Yeah. Bro, can I just say, dude, the hollow nest was fucking really stressing me out when I went like the first time after the 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 what is the mantis lords. The hall. Oh yeah. Deep that nest. Shit was the fuck out. <laughs> yeah, deep nest. Deep nest is a lot when you first play. Yeah, dude, that shit was terrifying, and I didn't know what was going on. Fair enough. All right, so I don't think there's anything for me here that I can do right now because I need dash for that. I'll wait for this guy. See if this leads anywhere. I don't really remember the whole map layout. Oh, that's just fog. Can't, or fog place. God damn it. I don't want to die. Please don't let me die. I love the boss concepts in this game. Yeah. The boss, sorry, not the concepts. The bosses themselves. They are very, they are very good. Yeah, I fought a lot of bosses in this game. Yeah. Probably too many. You, know, you, can fight, you can never fight too many bosses. Well, I mean, like, 
Unless you're unless you're playing like Mario 3D World or something. I did the Pantheon of Hollow Nest like a lot because I wanted to, you know, complete it. I never did though, because I was bad. Still am, but you know. Yeah. Have you? Do you know what the Pantheon of Hollow Nest is? Yeah, uh, what's it called? Um, one of my other friends plays Hollow Knight to the point where like this motherfucker is 100% completed it several times. Same. And like he legitimate, like I mean full Pantheon. I did, I've done everything, I, I can't do, I've done everything except for all of the Grey Prince Zote cycles and the Pantheon of Hollow Nest. I've gotten close though, but Absolute Radiance just keeps kicking my ass. <coughs> Yeah, no, but he's done all that shit, and he's shown me, and I'm just like, no. Like, I, when I say no, I mean, like, I'll try it, but, like, no. You want to try it? You want to try the Pantheon of Hollowness? Yeah, I'll try, but, I like like I said, I'm not good. So, like, I'll, honestly, I don't I don't think I'll complete it, but I'll try, so. Has he done Path of Pain? Huh, he has. That's, yeah. I did. I only managed to do, do that once out of all of mine, because that just, it sucks. Yeah, fair enough. Just, he, he, he's like, well, he's one of those where like he's he's like really smart without trying. So he's just like, oh yeah, it's it's not, it's really not that bad. Like he's like, oh, it kind of sucks at first, but once you get this, this, this and that, and do this, this and that, like like once you finally understand it, this then it's it's super easy. I like throwing enemies into the acid. Oh, dude, that's the funnest part about that area, especially when the corpses decay. Like, you hear him dissolve and shit. Oh yeah, that, that's, that's actually funny to me. That's funny to me because it's just like, uh-huh. Alright, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, before exploring anywhere else, I'm just gonna go to get Dash, because I, you know, need that to get everything in Green Path. Yeah. So I'll just, I'll just keep going on. Fight the yeah, boss, man. and then, you know, go on from there. The game was so much longer than I had thought initially. Oh yeah, I love this game. Since this was like one of my first Metroidvanias, besides a uh, cave story, I don't think I can do like uh, the Metroid shooting stuff because you know, atrocious aim. Oh well, yeah, I was gonna say because you've been playing games that are primarily like get up close and fucking kill that bitch. Yeah, you very close, close combat. Yeah. The funny part about Metroid is it's not full shooter. Like, realistically, you're gonna probably have a bunch of enemies that are right in front of you, too. Oh yeah, that's with any game. Yeah, because if you have, like, if you don't have, like, godly aim, Metroid can be really tough. <laughs> like, in terms of, like, there's just enemies that just, like, straight up just fucking aim bot you yeah and my aim is notoriously ass like across any game that's why i always go melee yeah that's fair for me i'm just like a middle ground like i i can do metroid like, i can just... i can i can do uh, i can do uh ranged attacks but only if it's like a good like aiming system you know yeah like not holding my hand but like or or it, it just like I can hit a moving, I can hit a... I'm not good at predicting paths, basically. Fair enough. Besides I that, I'd say my aim is alright. If you wanted a Metroid game that does actually include some kind of like physical combat, or at least a counter, I would say that Dread is like perfect because a lot of it involves the counter, which is like pseudo-physical. Uh... I see. It's one of those where it's like more into the combo style, but not super, not super much. Like it's just to like a degree that makes it easier. I see. But it still uses like, um, it still uses the shooter format. Yeah. I quite liked Dread. I will say a couple of bosses like irked me, but not because they're hard. It's just like they were like less creative or such. But like in general, like the actual, the actual game is always really good. I remember when I used to farm these guys for money. Oh, dude, I always farmed them for money. That shit was so fun. That and the big dudes over in uh, the, the, cross, the crossroads. Yeah. I did these guys since they were closest to a bench. 
Yeah. Well, I did the crossbows for the longest time because I wanted to just get everything that was right there immediately. Yeah. I, uh... And I wait. So. Because backtracking be damned for me. <laughs> You're backtracking be damned. This boy has to cook. For real. Uh... Then you didn't like the fog, the fog canyon, did you? The fog canyon was only a bit annoying. It wasn't that long, so it didn't really like affect me that much. Really? I, th I don't know. English is hard. It's fine. I, I I don't understand it either. I like how you don't get access into to fog canyon until like the end of the game. Yeah. It's it's actually it's literally the last place you can explore. It's really funny. I mean, if you don't know where uh, King's Pass is, that could probably be one of them. But Fog yeah. Fog Canyon is like the last place you you map out in the game. Which is funny yeah. considering it's one of the earliest places you actually go to. Yeah. No map for this area. What? I didn't even know about it for the longest time. Yeah. Especially since Cornifer is just over there taunting you. Alright, I need dash for this, I'm pretty sure. I said I was gonna go do dash. Why didn't I just listen to that? I'm so stupid. I was wondering what you were doing, but I didn't want to question you. Maybe you should start doing that more. But I always do that and get mad. Yeah, but that's that's content. <laughs> yeah, let me just break you. What the fuck? I mean, like, don't call me an idiot. Just be like, I think you need dash for that. But then you're then sometimes I I kind of feel like you're gonna go and then you're gonna go fucking. <laughs> oh my god, a boss! I had no idea this thing was a boss when I first fought it. By the way. Honestly, I would consider it a part of mini bosses. I wouldn't even consider it a full boss. No, it's a boss. Really? Yeah, it's in the. Oh, then, oh, then it's, oh, then I guess yeah. Wow, that there. thing died a lot faster than I remember. Maybe that's just because. No, I killed it just as fast. Trust me. It, well, it, no, it, it's it's because I'm used to fighting it in the uh, the arenas and stuff. Oh yeah. <laughs> like usually, it takes like a few. Powered up blasts for that, like to uh -huh. to kill it. And that's like with full nail upgrades and all that. Yeah, that. I fell. Don't damn me. Is that a grub? Is that a grub? It is a grub. Would the dev be mad if I ate some of his grubs? Would the dev be mad if I ate his grubs? Yeah. Probably. Why? I don't know. The granddad eats the grubs. Spoilers, by the way. They are full of calories, bro. Are they? Yes, bro. They got hella protein. I need to eat those grubs. Protein? The ability? Yes. Hey, you sound just like this guy. Thank you. It's pretty impressive considering you can't hear it. Yeah, I, I legitimately can't. There's nothing. <laughs> on my side, on my side, like, what, like if I just go silent for a second, that's just how I sound. That, that's how I hear. That's all I hear. Uh. I just see you beating people up without hearing any of it. Yeah. But like, I, I can ima I can like hear the noises. Like, if I think about it, like I I I, rem I remember the specific noises of when you hit something. You know. Yeah, I don't think you'll be able to hear any audio from now on, at least from the game. 
Yeah, that's fair. Uh, that's fine. I'm, I'm not too pissed about it. Yeah, it's uh, it's to get rid of the delay for all of the stuff. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah, sorry about that. No, that's all good. Okay. It, it, it's, it's necessary. Yeah. Shut up, you stupid little, uh, whatever you are, hedge guy. Stupid little, oh my god. I don't think I'd ever recover from someone calling me a, a wanker IRL, you know? Yeah, I wouldn't either. Like, that shit would hurt. My balls hurt. You know what else hurts? Your fat cock in my Okay. Well. <laughs> take it as a compliment. <laughs> I will take it as a compliment. My, this place has changed so much. Alright, time to fight. Uh, one of the most annoying bosses in the game anyway. Oh well. Which one is that? I think this is the wrong way. It. Oh, yeah. Honestly, no, I think Hornet's second fight was so much worse for me, but that's because I kept trying to rush it. I did rush it and I succeeded. I didn't because I was stupid. I think, I mean, what? You I, think? I, I said, I was gonna say I fingered, but <laughs> I, I don't want to finish that, so. <laughs> I'm not into bugs. I fingered. Well, I can't say that. There are some spiders I'd like to put. I mean, what? What? You wanna fuck? You wanna fuck a spider girl like Gwen Stacy? I see you creeping through the underground stalking you room. You can't put that ultimatum on that. <laughs> <laughs> this old thing on the table thing awakens. Uh, man, this this guy deadass got shanked in Green Path. How could he? Okay, my jumps are still delayed. Here's the real question. If Ryan Reynolds was a bug, what bug would he be? A beetle? You think so? I don't know, maybe. Why are you asking me what bug he'd be? Because we're back all night. Yeah, that's fine. Um... <laughs> is he usually a bug in any other media? No. He's never appeared as a bug before. Let me see. Let he me wasn't see. casted in the bug's life. Let me see. Has? Alright. Has Ryan Reynolds played a bug? No. He threw spaghetti at me. That's not fair. And I'm just hearing a lot of shaws. Yeah, no, he hasn't. Well, that's a crying shame. That is a crying shame. I wonder what kind of bug he would be. What bug do you think he would be? That's what I'm trying to think about. Like, what bug do I think? What bug would you have sex with? What is a really, like, visually pleasing insect? I don't okay. know. I, the visually pleasing insect? I like moths. I was gonna say, do you think like some kind of butterfly or moth would be good? I like moths and butterflies. Or uh, moths and spiders are my two favorite uh, things. I think he would be a type of really elegant spider. I think he'd be a snake. Do you think he'd be a snake? No, I was just insulting his character, sorry. I was gonna say, that's 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 very rude. Very, very rude. Oh hey, the guy <laughs> fell over so I can steal- so I can disrobe him and steal his clothing. Right? That's hot. Right? Is that- is that what you would do to Ryan Reynolds? Steal his mothwing cloak? Okay, I just got smoted. Which seek to break the seal. If they cannot be undone, they must be undone. Let us sleep, little shadow. Return to your darkness. Allow us our peace. 
to start a religious prayer. You know, if if the Watcher wasn't a guy, they'd all be pretty bangable. I, I, hmm. <laughs> I'm trying to I'm trying to think. <laughs> what is my response to that? What is your response to that? Um, I need to know. Eh, pretty much. <laughs> Did you know that the Watcher was a dude? Huh? Yeah. Uh, did you know that the other two were women? No. Yeah. Uh, I just what? assumed all of them were guys. You do realize that the insect one gave birth to Hornet, right? Like the spider one that you find in Deep Nest? She, Hornet oh. tells you that. Oh yeah, well I knew, I know, I knew like, I knew Hornet was... Yeah, okay, well I knew to some degree, but not... It's it's weird. My understanding was very convoluted. So honestly, I don't don't blame me. <laughs> All right, guys, that's gonna be it for this episode. See you in the next one. Later.